welcome to Feed Dump, where it's fall and that means it's football season and the leaves are turning and there's tons of Republican candidates all going, ah, gee, maybe not. Whew. Uh, you know, don't, don't worry about it. I'm Scott Walker and I was the governor of Wisconsin and I did some things that were bad and dumb and even I don't know what I stood for. Joining me this week is Rick Perry. For sale. One pair of presidential smart guy glasses. Only lightly used. And Kanye West. Wait, I thought you weren't running until 2020. Yeah, and that means I'm not running now. A 26-year-old Brooklyn man was rushed to the hospital after police caught him urinating in public and he tried to ditch the gun he was illegally carrying and he ended up shooting himself in the groin instead. And that's why it's always important to use both hands. Wait, how do you fit both hands on? You just line them up, like both sort of in the same, point in the same direction. I mean, you might have to turn them sideways a bit. Oh yeah, like John Woo style. Like... <laughs> There is nothing more awkward when the dude next to you is taking a piss and just doves start flying out. Or when you're watching a movie and the good guy can go through a whole bathroom scene without reloading his penis. And that's why I always keep my penis disassembled in a locked cabinet when I'm not using it. That's right, Andrew. This is just basic penis safety. If we're not responsible with our penises, the government will come take them from us. And Obama's not getting his hands on my penis. You know, Ian, I feel like you're taking your role as Rick Perry a little too far here. <laughs> you know, we have a lot of fun here at Feed Dump, but shooting yourself in the junk is a problem that's more common than you might realize. Famous football player Plaxico Barres once went into the club wearing sweatpants with a gun tucked into the waistband and shot himself in the dick. He wore sweatpants to a club? A South Dakota man is very upset after someone stole his prized 100 pound giant pumpkin from his yard. Apparently it still had another month left to grow and could have been 120 it hadn't been so brazenly thefted. Why couldn't you wait for pumpkin spice lattes? It's not even October. You want to buy a contraband pumpkin? I can feel it kick. Look, if I'm going to make a pumpkin pie in a kiddie pool, I'm either going to need a lot of small pumpkins or one really big pumpkin, and I'm a busy man. Now, I'm not saying I'm soft on crime, but uh, where exactly is this pie? You know, I'm beginning to have my suspicions about the farmer. If Charlie Brown has taught me anything, the great pumpkin doesn't actually exist. The great pumpkin is real, and he will bathe in your fucking blood. Oh, we are having one or two little problems at the moment. A man from East Yorkshire was rushed to the hospital with a five-day-long erection after he decided it would be a good idea to eat 35 Viagra pills in one sitting. In a row? According to my calculations, that's 3.3 hours per pill, which is perfectly normal. Oh, thank God. <laughs> for, for the pill, Andrew, not for your penis. Oh, shit. Can you hold my gun? So this guy's five-day-long erection actually mostly lasted for two days. That was the extent of the constant erection. And then it went down, but for the next three days, every time he, like, felt a breeze or heard a mouse fart, he would get another painful erection. And eventually that went away. But the other side effect was that uh, he was dizzy, he was uh, nauseated, and he started hallucinating. Everything he saw was green. Uh, so don't take 35 Viagra pills. If you needed me to tell you that. God damn it. Can Ian put on more clothes? Or less clothes? Oh man, I'm really not sure anymore. Do we get a green screen for this? Okay, with one feed dump host down and the other one probably needing medical attention ASAP, we're going to call this episode to a close. But remember, if you have an erection that lasts for more than four hours because you took a handful of Viagra, you are dumb and it is your fault. And there may be better sources of news, but they don't have this hat, which is super, super baller and super, super heavy. And I feel if I was FKA Twigs, I would look amazing in this hat, but I am not. I am like the polar opposite of FKA Twigs. She is just like super cool and can dance. And I'm like, not cool, and I look like a jellyfish having a seizure. So, yeah, feed dump. Jazz hands. That's cool, right? That's what the kids are doing these days. I'm a little confused as to why he had the gun while he was peeing. I mean, has Stand Your Ground gone that far? 
I think that's actually wide stand your ground.